Crisia para mí es... Crisia, to me, is an angel sent from heaven. She's my baby. I adore her. But overall, Crisia, to me, is a warrior. Even though she's always had this condition with her heart, she has always had the desire to live. In 2016, we were introduced to the Yucatan Heart Program with Mercy Medical Des Moines, and we have been fortunate enough to work with them to provide the air transportation to bring 20 kids a year into their hospital for specialized heart surgeries. It takes four organizations to pull this off, Mercy Medical, Children's Flight of Hope, through our partnership with American Airlines, as well as a governmental agency in Mexico that identifies the patients to begin with. So each year, uh, one of us from our group, uh, the pediatric cardiologist, goes down uh, to Mexico along with a team of uh, physicians and nurses. We see three to four hundred patients in four days. Selecting the children is really the, the hardest part of the, the whole job is because there's so many patients who do need surgery. Um, we try to select the kids that we can do the most good for. And Crisia tiene... Crisia suffers from tetralogy of fallot, which is four different defects in the heart. She didn't have strength. She wasn't gaining weight. She was very thin, very frail. After the physicians go and decide on who they're going to bring over to the United States for these surgeries, they give me a list, and then that's when my, my job starts. Once I have all the required documents, then that's when I reach out to Children's Flight of Hope. It has been wonderful to work with Mercy Medical in Des Moines um, to know that they have the one and only program that can provide life-saving care for these kids. All of the families that we work with are under tremendous stress. And a lot of times the transportation piece is the largest hurdle that they can face. And what's important about these international families is that it's all compounded by the length of travel required. It's a 30-hour process. And what Children's Flight of Hope does for all of our families, domestic, local, international, you name it, we alleviate the burden of air transportation. Oh, Children's Flight of Hope has been phenomenal. They are so easy to work with. If there's a patient who needs to stay a little bit longer because surgery was delayed or any complications, I, I just know that they're going to be so accommodating and kind and and respectful. I mean, they completely respect our, our program and what we do and what I do. They take care of all of the flights for us. And without getting these kids here, the program wouldn't even be able to survive. For these Yucatan families, they don't speak the language. They are unsure how to navigate the airport. Some of them have never flown before. I was definitely nervous about the flight. I was more nervous about having my daughter with me on the flight because it's such a long trip and keeping her calm and keeping her seated and entertained. It was very tiring, but my strength came from knowing that this procedure would change her life. So I grabbed her in one arm and my suitcase in the other and made myself walk through it. Upon arrival in Des Moines, they are excited and exhausted and are quickly whisked away into a van to take them straight to the hospital. And then they enter a battery of tests and scans and move very quickly into deciding what the next step is. Um, and for Crisia, that meant surgery the very next day. Those hours when they're back there in the operating room are eternal. All I wanted the entire time she was back there was for her to come out so I could hold her and hug her. I know it was a difficult surgery, but at the same time, I had faith that everything would come out okay. The real payoff for us is we don't get paid anything to do this. Uh, the payoff is when we go back down there and see the patients and the families can't wait to, to show us how, how well their child is doing. Without American Airlines, we would not be able to provide international support to families in need of accessing treatment here in the U.S. Over the last three years, American has provided us with almost 100 million airline miles to use for kids in need here locally, um, nationally, and internationally. Tengo muchas esperanzas. I have so many hopes for her. With the prognosis that they've given for her recovery, she's going to be a normal little girl. Gracias a todos. Thank you to everyone, to everyone, everyone, everyone. Without this, I don't know where we'd be. 
I want to thank our donors, our corporate sponsors, our volunteers, our staff. It's your commitment to us every single day that puts us in the position to save so many lives and impact so many families around the world. Thank you.